What is up, you guys? Welcome back to another one. If you're new to the channel, I'm Gold Pony. This is Gold Pony Crypto. So I wanted to do this video from my car because it is snowing out here in April, and this isn't right. This isn't right. Where it's spring, there should not be this much snow. You can't even see out my window right now. So maybe I'll try to open it up later in the video, and hopefully all the snow doesn't come piling in. But anyways, per your request, I wanted to make a quick tutorial on Mad Meerkat Finance, their decks, and how to go about using it because it is probably, without a doubt, the most comprehensible decks on Chronos right now. There's so much to do within it. And of course, they are the number one decks on Kronos as well, due in part because it is so comprehensive. So ultimately, in this video, this will be a very beginner-friendly Mad Meerkat Finance tutorial on the deck. So we will be going over everything about it. Nothing in this video should be considered financial advice. Please do your own research. And before we get started, if you did want to go ahead and sign up for Mad Meerkat Finance when you sign up, feel free to use my referral link. It's going to be in the description box below as well as in the pinned comment. It's not like Crypto where you actually get anything, but I get an added 1% that Mad Meerkat supplies based on your earnings. So you keep 100% of your earnings, but then I get 1% on top of that as well. So it's gonna come out to a very, very small amount, I'm sure, but doesn't hurt you and it helps me a little bit. So if you wanna be selfless and help the channel out, I appreciate it. And so anyways, let's first start with the why. Why you wanna check out Mad Meerkat Finance? Because reason being it is the most comprehensive decks on Kronos. And the reason I say that most DEXs give you staking and some yield farming, but Mad Meerkat does give you staking. It gives you a ton of yield farming and I'll go over where that is and how to go about doing that as well. And of course, it also gives you that swap feature. It gives you a bridge feature, but it also gives you a games feature. You can roll dice, you can flip a coin, you can play roulette. And of course, it also gives you NFTs. You guys may have heard of the Mad Meerkat NFT. That is the number one seller on Abyssus Bay. And of course, Mad Meerkat has their own platform for NFTs as well. I'll be touching on that. Mad Meerkat Treehouse NFT as well. And also there is a new NFT coming up that will be touching on the very end of this video by Mad Meerkat that you are not going to want to miss. I'll probably do a separate video on that later down the line. But anyways, so let's actually go ahead and start at the beginning, how to go about getting into Mad Meerkat Finance, the decks. And so first thing you want to obviously do is download the Crypto.com DeFi wallet. I'm going to assume if you're looking into this decks, you have probably already done that. But if you have not, go ahead and just go to your app store and download the crypto.com DeFi wallet not the same thing as the crypto.com centralized exchange app next thing you're obviously going to want to do is to fund that DeFi wallet typically people will do this through crow because everything in DeFi through the DeFi wallet through the crypto.com DeFi wallet is done through crow what you want to do when you do that is make sure that it is chronos not the crypto.org chain not ethereum but Kronos, because the Kronos chain is what DeFi runs on. And so how to go about getting to it, once you pull up that crypto.com DeFi wallet, in the very bottom middle of the screen it is going to be an icon labeled dApps. Go ahead and hit that, and just in that first section, you can find it a couple different ways, but just in that first section, it is going to be right there within the popular dApps column. So go ahead then and select Mad Meerkat Finance. So on the main screen, I'm just gonna glance down at my phone so I don't miss anything, but main screen, first off, they're announcing that they are on the crypto.com app now so if you search mmf on the crypto.com centralized app you are going to find them which is pretty cool that just happened recently so they still got that up there but at the very bottom all of these different icons you got trade you got earn DeFi, launch games and then there's a little section for essentially everything else and we're going to be touching on all of these icons here and so let's go ahead and start with trade and so a lot of different dexes will call this different things some will call it exchange and some will call it swap essentially i like to think of it as the swap feature but you can do a couple different things you can of course swap tokens. So if you have all of that crow that I just said to put in there like I do, you can swap that into any other supported token within the decks, like let's say Madbucks, which I am currently trying to accumulate more of, due in part because of the new NFT collection that Mad Meerkat has coming out. Again, I'll touch on that later, but that is how you're going to go ahead and use that trade function or swap function. You select the token you want to swap from. In my case, it would be Crow. Then you select the token that you want to swap to. It could be Madbucks. It could be MMF. It could be MShare. It could be anything there that is available. And then in this particular instance, and of course this does vary slightly, but it says my fee is going to be 0.346 Crow. So extremely low. That comes out to be approximately at the time of this video, 13 cents. So compare that with Ethereum. <laughs> and of course, within this trade functionality, you also have the ability to bridge between tokens as well, between blockchains, I really should say. So that is going to be there for you as well. But then the next icon at the bottom of the screen is going to be earn. And this is where you're going to have 
the staking features. And so you could stake via farms, pools, and vaults. What I typically would recommend here, and again, this isn't financial advice, but this is what I would do, and this is what everyone else appears to be doing based on everything that I've seen on Twitter, is go ahead and go with the vaults because that pushes you into the Mad Meerkat Optimizer page, which is really where the best returns are to be had. And so this is where you see the 100,000% APRs and the 60,000% APRs and the crazy numbers that you don't even know how even exist, but they do. So this is where that happens. And again, and this is probably what I would recommend if you're looking for some massive gains and you believe in the Mad Meerkat Finance platform like I do. So again, not financial advice. I just wanted to put all that out there. And let's go ahead and move on to the next icon, which is DeFi. And so this is where you're going to find the first ever DEX traded fund through mad etf or i'm sorry metf i don't know why i said mad mad etf but essentially staking and bonds are going to be offered through metf so that is one section of this particular icon and then savannah finance is going to be the algorithmic stable coin that they have next icon is going to be launched and this essentially is their launch pad they most recently launched a couple things here there was scrub finance that was one of them and then also mad bucks which is kind of part of the mad box section but still part of their launch pad essentially so that's where you're going to find upcoming projects for their launch pad. There are none currently available that I can show you guys, but they're constantly putting them out. And one of the other cool features about their launch pad is that rug, they have teamed up with rug doc, which is a outside company that essentially vets these projects that go through their launch pad program now. So you can be assured that they're less likely to be a rug pull. So I love that they did that. I know this is all supposed to be decentralized, but I kind of prefer the rug doc aspect in this particular case, because kind of gives everybody a little added peace of mind. So they know that their money is not at least going to be lost from a rug pull, but rather maybe through the markets going down. Not that you want your money to be lost either way, but you don't want it to be lost from a rug pull. That's all I'm saying. Next icon at the bottom of the screen. This is one of my favorite parts. I don't know why. It's the games feature. And this, so this is going to be done through Croissant Games. And so they have different things like a coin toss, which you actually have several different options for different cryptos you can do that coin toss with, or you used to wager, I guess. There's also going to be roulette there's going to be crow roll and dice roll as well which is all pretty fun concepts so if you're the gambling type or you like a little mini casino within your decks this is one of the things that really makes my meerkat finance stand out which i i get a kick out of but anyways and so the last icon that i'm going to show you guys essentially includes everything else that they have to offer and this is a lot there's coin analytics at the very top there there's the referral program info so if you wanted to shill your referral code to somebody else and again they don't actually get anything out of it nothing happens whatsoever for them but you get an extra one percent of their gains which are not funded by them again but rather funded by mad meerkat finance that's kind of cool and the very best part in my personal opinion is their nfts and so this is where you're going to go ahead and access them and so they have had three nfts so far they've had their mad meerkat nft on ethereum which is where they started all the madness and they had their crow mad meerkat nft which of course was on chronos which is what you typically are going to see with in their decks as well as on Abyssus Bay. And then lastly is the Mad Meerkat Treehouse. And currently they're at a floor price of approximately 14,000 crow, which is absolutely nuts. And there's tons of utilities for all these NFTs and I've touched on a good bit of them in some of my other videos, but that's why the floor prices are obviously so high. But of course you can buy and sell these through their decks, through Agora, through Abyssus Bay. But this of course through their decks is one way you can go ahead and access and buy those NFTs if you wanted to take part in them. But anyways, one of the other things I wanted to mention because more than likely this mint is going to take place within the deck so again therefore it's kind of nice to know how to use this decks the mad meerkat finance decks here so and that's going to be the dgen mad meerkat nft mint that is coming up in approximately three or four weeks from the time of this video and so this essentially is the version three of the meerkats the first version was on ethereum second version was on chronos and then this third version it's still on Kronos, but you don't actually pay for it in Crow this time. You're going to pay for it in Mad Token. So let me let me give you a brief synopsis of this. And again, like I said at the beginning of the video, this will probably be its own separate video down the line here with me. And so this is going to be essentially similar utility as the Crow Men Meerkats. You can stake them. You can use them for a little bit of boost on MMO. And so they're saying you're going to get a 2% boost for the D-Gen Cats as opposed to a 3% boost for the Crow Men Meerkats. You can also use them for a boost on your Mad Meerkat 
treehouse staking, so that's what I would use it for, you would get 7% for the DGen cats as opposed to the 10% for the crow cats. Of course, you're going to be able to see all the new Mad Meerkat art with this collection, which I'm personally looking forward to as well because the art is always on point. There are going to be 10,000 available again in approximately three to four weeks. It's going to be a whitelist round that goes first, and the public round is going to go second. Essentially, I think the whitelist round is going to completely sell out from the get go. I really don't think the public round is going to happen whatsoever, but the way to get on that whitelist mint is you're going to have to own a ETH Mad Meerkat, a Crow Mad Meerkat, or a Mad Meerkat Treehouse, one of those three. As far as the pricing goes, it's going to cost 55 Mad to mint on the whitelist. Public Mint is going to be 75 Mad. And one of the best parts is all of this Mad that they are going to get from the Mint will then be burnt which I think they said is like 375,000 MAD or something, which is nuts to think about considering the price of MAD is what, 21, 22, something like that, $22 or something. So again, I'll make a separate video on this drop later down the line. But ultimately, that's my brief layout of the Mad Meerkat Finance decks. It's definitely one that you wanna be familiar with if you're planning on using any decks. It's my personal favorite right now on Kronos. Although I have used other ones, I've used VVS Finance, I've used Cyborg Swap, I use Kronos, decks I, i've used a good bit of them but this one is still i believe my favorite at this point in time just because it's the most comprehensive i guess but let me know if you guys have any questions in the comments section below let's see if uh let's see if we can knock this snow out real quick here Ah! Now my pants are soaked. That's great. Anyways, you guys can probably see it is snowing outside. I'm not lying to you. It's it just ain't right, man. Let me know if you have any <laughs> let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below. That is about it for this one, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to follow me on social media if you wanted to see different cryptocurrency updates. Be sure to hit the subscribe and the bell notification button. If you're into crypto.com, crow and chronos, that is what we do here on this channel. After all, do appreciate you guys watching more than you know, and I will see you guys all in the next video. Stay gold.